个礼拜飞。Talk and film. Mm -hmm. We're doing something illegal. I don't know if we're supposed to sit here, but whatever. So we are in uh, Port of Princesa uh, in the island of Palawan, and um, we we arrived in Manila last night or afternoon. We just had some dinner and drinks and then we got up at 3 this morning and we flew to Palawan. Haven't been wearing makeup, just relaxing. A little bit stressed with some of the flight times. We had a change in time as well. Abel has a very sore back. His, his back is hurting so... We came to lay down for a second and to stretch out his back because we have a very, very long bus ride ahead. I think it's about five hours that he's going to have to sit in the bus and we'll be going all the way up to El Nido. Uh, to be honest, we have been pretty disappointed with the food in the Philippines. Um, it's just been like Western food that's done really badly. like pasta and last night we had like fish and chips which was terrible and um, the pork was good though uh, Philippines are big on the pork so I, I think we'll try that again this trip oh my god Abel you're snoring in my video am I? <laughs> no. you did oh. anyways um, we're gonna lay it for about an hour and I go to the bus uh, minivan that I booked um, yeah and it's so pretty here look 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 I'll show you guys and I know you're the one a story is just because around El Nido and have a good time. It's hot. Hey baby, it's hot. Huh? It's super hot. No, it's really hot. Woo. Uh, seven, seven commando. Tomato. Tomatoes. Commando. No, tomato. Tom seven tomato. No. Really? I heard that. I don't. Seven commando. That's what I heard. It's not an it island, thinks. but it's part of the mainland of El Nido, and it's so pretty. I love the palm trees. <laughs> Canadaba is a Filipino food. Oh, yeah. 
Oh, Jana. <laughs> <laughs> really good. Mm -hmm. It's similar to Japche in Korea, mm -hmm. but it's better. <laughs> <laughs> it's much better than Japche. <laughs> it's good. And some chicken, some rice. <laughs> to get this video like to look how it looks in person because it's so much better we are finishing up our island hopping tour and it was so so fun so relaxing spend a lot of time in the sun and in the water when snorkeling like a few times it was amazing i got such a, a burn but i'm feeling so relaxed and this is like exactly what I needed, um, some vacation time. just got to Porto Princesa after a five hour bus. It was more than five hours this time. We had a few pit stops. The bus driver had really bad peas. And so we just got here and the first thing we did is we jumped into the pool. And now we're having an amazing dinner. Um, mm -hmm. I'm having pizza, I've been craving pizza. And Abel's having some traditional um, Filipino food. I'm gonna show you guys, he's having some pork and some beef. What is that, baby? I don't know, but it's fried pork. Fried pork. And shrimp sauce. Shrimp sauce. And, and vegetables. Damn, does it really taste like shrimp? Oh, no, but it's amazing. Uh, I'm not a good, big fan of shrimp, so but, I don't but know. But it's not tasting like shrimp. It's not tasting like pad thai. Really? Pad thai? Mm. And then that one is beef. Yeah. 
And then I'm having a very cheesy pizza with no garlic. <laughs> I'm really not a garlic fan, but looking amazing. And their presentation is so cute. Look at this. They have the little sunflowers. It's very cute. This hotel has been really, really nice. Ciao, mo kasimni da. So we just had a layover in Manila and we flew to Borkai and we're in Borkai we took a van to the port and now we have to take a boat to the to the island and then we have to take a tuk tuk baby to the hotel. So it's quite a mission but it's actually very fast paced and affordable and the people here are so, so nice, like they help you with everything um, and everything is really organized so it's been very smooth safe. No problems, it goes fast. In the Philippines, everyone has been treating you like a celebrity. How do you feel about that? Korean idol actor. Ah! Tell people I'm from Africa, they're like, oh, cool. And if you say Korea, they're like, Korea! <laughs> Last night we had some mango ice flakes and they were amazing. But I didn't feel like filming last night, so uh, we have to go again. Yep. What is it? Mom and pop shop. M Mare what? Mom and pop shop. Mom and pop? Yep. Like this, mom and pop shop? Yeah. In Korea? No, in Vietnam. But uh -huh. maybe in Vietnam, it's the same. Ah. It's muddy here. The rain comes in rows. No, thank you. One thing about the Filipinos, even though they are so hospitable and nice, they do not leave you alone to sell the same freaking product everywhere. The beach is so windy here. Wow, there's a little sailboat. That's so, that's beautiful. It's so blue. Chilling. Wow, look at this huge mountain made by Sine. No, made by Abel. My ass is itchy so much, my upper leg. Can you see I'm dancing? I am. Are you twerking now? Seriously? <laughs> Whoa! Whoa! Oh, my back! Whoa! Oh, this is nice! Really? It feels like I'm sitting on a toilet, like a baby's... Wow! 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 Send men. Oh, that was fun. The difference between uh, South African 
and a Korean breakfast. <laughs> Abel always eats my like dinner food for breakfast, like noodles and chicken, anything for breakfast, right? This is breakfast? No. No. Korean. Korean's breakfast. <laughs> Coming to an end, unfortunately. It's been so fun. Uh, we decided to spend the day at the pool, just relaxing, soaking up like some sun, getting some swimming done. Later, gonna have a few cocktails, maybe get a massage. Um, because tomorrow we fly back to Manila and then to Seoul on Sunday, and then it's back to work. So yeah, we just want to make like have like a nice lazy day where we're not walking. Yesterday we walked for so long. We ended up like walking back from um, where we went snorkeling to our hotel, which was about like an hour's walk. And we usually like to walk just to um, like soak up like the, the local life, how people live and see some of like their lifestyle. It's the best way to learn about a new place. It's just by walking everywhere. So we walked here, we were so tired last night. And then we took a quick rest and Abel took me out or he surprised me for like a romantic dinner at the hotel, which was really nice. I'll put the pics in here. Um, yeah, it was so lovely. And we went to bed quite early last night and now we're here <laughs> by the pool. We had some brekkie and we're at the pool. It's so nice. The weather is perfect. It's sunny, it's really warm, but there's at least some clouds, so it makes it a little better. And um, yeah, anyways. I keep on thinking there's something on my nose, but it's just my freckle. <laughs> One thing I have to say is like the people are so friendly here. Like it feels like you're like the king and queen of England when you're here. They treat you with such respect and such kindness, and they are so hospitable. Um, only the best service in the Philippines everywhere has been, so that's been lovely. Um. Manila and then the Boracay cups, but they're not too beautiful. They're cute. Cebu and mugs. These ones are so cute.